Union. A good people, welcome to Public Show. Hello, hello, good people. Welcome back to Public Show. And today is an exciting episode that we are going to discuss and talk about because. Uh, in a few minutes, I'll be arriving at that place. I love to honor Vile Imambo Iko. The common if it is in a Frasia, Mona Vile Mutazichanga Mukia. Sawa sawa. So, we have Kera, Kenya Rural, uh, Kenya Roads uh, Rural Authority. Kenya Roads Rural Authority. To come you. Kera. Then, Kuna Ile Ngine, Kena, Kenya Highways Authority. Na Kuna Kuanga Nene, Tunaita Kura, Kenya Urban Roads Authority. Taza, Ie Nene, Tuna Discuss Hapa Ni, Kera, Ie Rural Areas. Now, due to Mambo Ya Rural Areas, Izi Magari Mingi, Utazipata Ziko, Siaya, Utazipata Ziko Wapi, Laikipia, uh, Zingine Ziko Wapi, Wacha Ni Kuanga Lile, Zingine Ziko, Kuna Gari Ziko Kilifi, Kuna gari ziko Narok, na kuna gari ziko Busia, na zingine ziko wapi, ziko wapi, ziko Siaya, na Kilifi. Uh, yeah, hizo ndizo areas Kera inafanya auctioning, but wenye wako I, within the city, kuna zo ziko mingi sana wapi. Hapa uh, Barabara, Plaza, JKIA, uko ndani, ndani, pale kwenye tunayendanga kila wakati, du edikota ya Kena iko hapo, na edikota ya Kera pia iko hapa, Barabara Plaza, inside Jomo Kenyanta International Airport. So good people, kama kawaida, tumefika pale wapi, pale Barabara Plaza, tumeza kuona magari, but before that, and uh, I'll be showing you the vehicles with in a car, and uh, the pricing plus kama condition iko worthy uh, the value yenye magari zimepewa so now tunaanza na gari ya kwanza nataka tuende faster yo nisiwaweke sana you the, the days remaining ni a few days before the auction date so tuanze na gari ya kwanza tunaanza na lot 1 Lot 1 ni Chevrolet, Chevrolet Cruiser. It's a petrol, which is a KBR-888U. Uh, KBR-888U. Iyo ugari iko reserved 550,000. 550,000. Condition ni hii gari, ni kiangalia vizuri. Ebu ni angalia hiyo gari. Ni white in color. Uh, Imeeko hiyo Lot 1. So... The exterior condition of this vehicle is in good shape. Wezi dispute. But... The problem yenye niko nayo uh, ni hiyo price yenye wameka ju wameka price yenye naona reserve price na the value mwenye alifanya valuation i think ame ame overbi ame overvalue this vehicle however labda magari zimepanda na pia serikali inataka kufanya ile kitu kupata pesa out of these auctions and uh, they believe that uh, pia nyinyi bidding it's no longer that cheap as you thought however Tuingie kwa lot uh, lot 2. Lot 2 tuko na gari gani? Tuko na pia Chevrolet Avio. It's a KBN. It's a KBN and it is reserved at 500,000. Looking at the condition of this vehicle Chevrolet Avio uh, lot lot 2. What do you think? Does it warrant Iyo bei wa meeka 500,000? Do you think it's worth it? Do you think it should uh, be a little bit less? Ama uh, iko hapo na wewe kama mnunuzi do you think uh, unaweza kuja uongeze ka kitu kwa hii gari uone kama eh naweza ichukua na 550 ama upunguze tena kuna mwingine labda wataona hii haiwezi iacho pale so in in some auction that tumefany tumekuwa zikifanyika unapata gari iliyeko kwa auction ika kaka tena ikaekwa next year you watu wanakuja wana wanaona hii gari bei iko juu sana wanaachana na but in this case Chevrolet spare part is iko available ndio ni maswali ngine tunafaa tujiulize who uh, get uh, any any particular part ya hii gari can you get it easily up within the market ama na postpone hii shuguli at the same time ni kuja kwa gari hii number 3 najua hii kila mtu anaitaka hii the condition of this vehicle is not that bad uh, kuringana na fununu most of these vehicles by the way zilijileta pale na in this case kera and quarters azikuanga hapa JKIA so kwenye zilikuanga ilibidi wakihamia hapa wakaama na magari zao mingi a uh, zili jileta zikapakiwa pale na uh, a few yenye sijui ni gani exactly 
ziliwekwa kwa towing zikaletwa pale na vile zilifika pale ni gari azijawahi toka pale at the same time kwa hizi magari kuna zenye zimefanyiwa kuangaliwa na ile fununu niko nayo zenye ziko hapa barabara plaza ni gari ziko in good shape in good condition nimepata testimony kidogo kidogo pale na nikaona ya hata ukiangalia hivi ni jua tu imeichoma hii gari ingine hapa naambiwa imeenda tu 10000 miles ilikuja tu ikaeko wapi hapo pop na watu wana, wengine hasa officials wa kera wanataka latest models wanataka gari comfortable more advanced so, unapata hakuna mtu hakuna watu wengi wanataka kuenda na hizi mzee mzee now kuna hiyo izuzu double cabin kbn kbn it is reserved at 350000 350000 um at least this one is a little bit affordable according to me naona ni bei yenye simba sana iko juu sana lakini tungependa ikuwe 250 mimi nasema hivyo twende lot 4 ndio mbio ndio tusikae hapa sana lot 4 tuko na Mitsubishi Pajero it's a V96W Mitsubishi hapa watu wa Mitsubishi fikeni hii soko mchanga muke teke teke tuone kama Uh, watu watapata vitu safi safi. Hii Mitsubishi imereserviwa how much? 400,000. 400,000 is the reserve price of this Mitsubishi Pajero. It's a lot for. Lot 5 tuko na Chevrolet ingine, Chevrolet Cruiser. It's a KBN 191E. It is reserved at 517,000. And something that I'm noticing is that all these Chevrolet zimereserviwa above 500,000. Chevrolet ni design ya said uzo to sedan. So, tutahafu kujua kama ni value ya Chevrolet imeenda juu ama ni nini. Who knows? Nobody. Then lot uh, lot 6 ni Mitsubishi Pajero. Lot 6 tuko na Mitsubishi Pajero which is a KBL reserved at 420,000. 420,000 aki valueta valuea you the you the you the valua easy gari umepeleka sana lakini who knows maybe they are in good shape and as it has mambo mengi 420000 is the reserve price for this vehicle nitaruka lot nitaruka lot Uh, lot 6 lot 7 na cause easy aziko jkia ziko pale enterprise road industrial area atajiona but kesho we will be seeing them na ni wa update vile ziko because zime reserve price safi kabisa tena nitawaambia ni bei gani kwa video ya kesho ndio tusichanganye kwa hii video ndio watu waone magari in special way but kama uko industrial area unaweza ndio angalizo gari za kera ziko pale so tukuja kwa lot 8 lot 8 tuko na Ford uh, we have a KBQ uh, KBQ 660 660 which is reserved at what the 1 million Kenya shillings this vehicle the exterior part of this vehicle is awesome hapo wezi complain uh uko chini kwa div ni div inaitwa div ama inaangwa nini um kiangalia vizuri ni kisumu kidogo naona uh, kuna oil inakaa kama imetoka toka lakini habla it's not a big deal the same time unaambua hiyo gari ni kuweka battery tu na kupiga kifunguo na kupiga shughuli however uh, Ford watu wengi hapa Kenya kuna wanasema Ford hapana wacha watafute Maisuzu D-Max Toyota Double Cabin waone kama hizo ndizo gari safi safi wacha nikimbie tena tuone lot lot what ndio ni siwaweke hapa sana juu kuna magari ziko different either. kuna gari hata imewekwa reserve ya 25000 kuna gari imewekwa reserve ya 50000 so ingine yenye iko hapa JKIA ni Ford Double Cabin which is a KBQ 660 it is reserved at uh, 700000 so reserve ya 700000 that one i think it uh, it's way high at the same time this vehicle's duties duty has been paid according to the information that I've gotten but when you are coming to bid please make sure that you get the all information ndio ujue una bid na bei ngapi usikuje kuweka pesa mingi na ujue kama hapa kinaweza kukulamba kwa kufanya nini kwa kufanya clearance ya hii gari now 
Turash kwa hizi gari zingine zenye ziko. Tuanze na gari yenye kwa Makueni. Makueni tuko na gari Mitsubishi Double Cup. It is reserved at 150,000. It's a KBJ030. So if you're in Makueni, go to Kera offices and check this vehicle. Na uone kama unaweza kuja Nairobi siku ya auction ubid hiyo gari ama hata utumane. Tuki Tugenda sihaya, sihaya, pare kera offices za sihaya, wakona gari inaito Isuzu Double Cabin, Isuzu Double Cabin, is a KBQ pale siyaya imerisaviwa 450,000 tukitoka siyaya tunaenda laikipia laikipia wakona gari yenye imerisaviwa 860,000 iyo naona pesa ni mingi nao ni gari gani it's a Ford Double Cabin imerisaviwa 860,000 if you're in laikipia go to Kera Lane offices and check this vehicle at the same time if you're in Kilifi go to Kera offices and see this Isuzu double cabin it's a kbn 180e it is reserved at 450,000. tukikimbia tena tukienda pare narok narok unapata kuna gari imekewa 216,000 peke yake it's a reserve price. Na hiyo gari ya Narok ni gani? It's a Mitsubishi Double Cabin. Pare Narok, if you're in Narok, please check that vehicle. Tutumie mapicha hapo. Tuone kama ni gari iko safi ama ni kitu yenye haiwezi. Tukikimbia tena Busia kuna magari mbili. Busia, Busia, tuende pale gari ya 25,000 iko pale Busia na gari also ya 50k iko pale Busia. Gari ya 25,000 Busia ni gani? Ni Mitsubishi Pajero which is lot 17. Na lot 18, tukona Isuzu Double Cabin, which is reserved at 50,000. E Double Cabin ya Busia ni KBN 178. Na e ingine Mistubishi Panjero ni KBN 180, 189, 189. Izo zote ziko Kera offices, izo area zote ni metaja. Now, Unaweza kuwa uko hapo na hey, he hii auction kwa nini ya siku gani? Hii auction inafanyika date 15 na itafanyika wapi? JKIA Barabara Plaza. Hapo tu headquarter ya Kera. Kwa parking lot tu, ukifika tu pale ndani utaelekezwa na uambiwe ni pale. Now, what is the deposit for you to bid these vehicles? You will require to pay 30,000 per lot. 30,000 per lot. That means in the event you don't get any of these vehicles, 30,000 is refundable. Na hii 30,000 for you to bid, utaenda u deposit your pesa Kwa Kera account, please. Mambo ikifika ya pesa na kuambia enda kwa website ya Kera. Get the uh, details of banking. Wende udeposit iyo pesa vizuri. Uziseme nilikupea account. Ika ingia kwa Pamrik. Alafu uanze kuniletea maneno. So, kitu ingine ya maana ni nini? Kitu ya maana ni who is the auctioneer. The auctioneer ni mzee wetu mzima. He is a guy that has been doing this thing for so many years. And... Uh, and I do trend and auctioneers. He will give you the best deals and he's the best in the game. So, wacha tuone vile atafanya hii mambo na tunajua everybody will be okay. And in the event, you know, ujapata information, kumbuka pia Kenna is auctioning vehicles. Kenna, Kenna is a Kenya Highways Authority, Tare Saba. So, viewing inaisha lini, inaisha I guess leo ama nikesho, date, uh, date 6. Na magari ziko pale, Adhi River, unaezaenda pale ufanye bidding. So guys, nime malizia. Na in the event you win your vehicle, utaambiwa any other information that is expected to know. Na if you would like maybe to see how the auction is happening, kama wana restrictions, unaeza kuja pale, uangalie vile mambo inafanyika, ama ulizie tunafununu ndio next time, ujipange. Sawa sawa. So guys... Thank you so much for tuning to Palmerick Show and uh, bearing with me because to me angaika sana kutafuta hizi magari back and forth, back and forth na procedure ya kuview utafika pale, uingie kwa ofisi, utadirektio, utapewa hizi hiyo receipt hizi juu, ya nini, nika process tu utaonyeshwa na kama ukue patient juu, ilibidi tungoji hapo like 30 minutes so I threw uh, but uh, ni vizuri kufuata procedures wherever you go. Sawa so, sawa. So, but kama uko mbali, hizo ni za magari zenye zina auctioniwa na kama uko area kama ya Siaya wapi wapi unaweza tutumia hizo gari zenye ziko hizo kwa hizo maofisi zao za Kera tuone vile ziko. 
so guys if you're new to this channel my name is patrick motuma and you're on palm Rick show if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet please consider doing so and remember to give us that thumbs up alafu kisikia each channel ina kuguzi na ungependa kuona mambo mingi zaidi then unaweza cheza kama wewe hapo kwa hiyo mpesa namba itatusaidia na lita kama mbili tatu hizi za fuel tupige shughuli hizi magari unasikia hatujaona hatujajipata ziko mbali na kufika place kama wakweni kilifi wapi ni pesa so whichever we get inatusaidia sana na tunaweza kupiga shughuli but either way thank you so much for the subscription tumefika karibu that 4000 tunaelekea kuelekea tunaelekea kuelekea this year tunagonga 100000 subscribers asanteni sana and mashukuru sana sana see you guys and until next time god bless pa 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 nimemaliza